Hey guys, this is Sperm Bruno, and um, today, as you can see on the title, I'll do a really cool effect, which is called, as you may all know, um, the Lomo effect. Uh, the Lomo effect uh, actually is Lomography. Um, again, uh, thank you, Tudfid, and uh, make sure you check him out because this basically uh, is from his idea. Um, so, as you can see here, we are going to recreate these awesome. Um, effects here and um, yeah it's it's a very cool effect uh, basically what uh, the Loma effect consists in doing is uh, playing with the curves and the gradient map uh, and obviously your photo so it it will take um, probably two minutes it's really really easy to do and you can do this effect on any kind of photos so as you can see we're gonna play with um, flashy colors and mix them up with darker colors so as you can see here this was a black and white photo and you can see this very cool effect alright so um, let me um, show you um, what to do <laughs> alright again sorry I had a small problem um, but don't mind that alright just um, so basically what you're gonna do you're gonna click on file you're gonna click on open you're gonna choose your uh, basic image which obviously is going to be very cool and so we are going to take the same in image as before and alright so it's this one um, I hope this time I won't mess up the whole thing and alright so um, I always take the, the lock the lock thing off uh, but you can do whatever you want you can just you can just make it stay there I just take it off so I have more freedom alright so uh, first of all we're gonna play with the curves so we are going to click on layer new adjustment layer yep new adjustment layer curves 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 okay alright now we're gonna play with the curves uh, which are very awesome um, let me see here I'm just gonna put the panel up here and um, yeah so we're gonna play with the curves um you're not obliged to make a new layer so new layer adjustment layer and curves you can just go on image and adjustments and curves but I just do this you know uh, and that's kind of dumb for me because I don't know it's smaller so you won't be able to see it that much but anyways alright so basically what we're gonna do here we're gonna fix the light a little bit so we're gonna put an S, okay? So put the S like this, and we're gonna go to the green here, and we're gonna do the same thing. We're gonna put a basic S here. All right, that's very awesome. Then we're gonna go to the blue. Um, uh, just be careful here. Do not do an S. Just do an opposite S alright so that is the opposite S and last but not least we're gonna go to the red and do an S alright again you're not obliged to be precise as hell but you know it's always better so we're gonna put this back over there so this was our adjustments all right. Um, next thing, so as you can see here, we have this very cool layer. So we already have a big change here, as you can see, and um, you can just yeah, you're basically done. Um, another step, uh, which is very important, if you want to even make it better, you know, if you really want to make it professional, you know, like rap album or rock album, you know, like low mo effect and cool. Basically, what you're going to do is you're going to go on images, oh sorry, a layer, you're going to do a new adjustment layer, and you're going to go on gradient map, alright, now click OK, and you'll get this, that is not important, do not worry, you did not destroy your whole image, we're going to fix this immediately. Set the opacity of this gradient map layer to 50, alright, enter. And uh, voila! Now you're gonna see this this awesome um, effect 
So you're going to click this small arrow here on layer and overlay the layer and voila, you get this awesome loam effect. Flashy green uh, flashy with dark and also this kind of purplish um color uh, which actually shows the the darker places. So the darker places basically are, are replaced with this kind of bluish, purplish, really cool color. And um, the other uh, parts, like the lighter parts, are replaced with even more HD and even more flashy color. So as you can see here, the progress we want. So we pass to the curves from this to this. Um, so you can play remember you can just play with this so you're not obliged to do the gradient map it I think the gradient map is even better but again you're not obliged to do this um, so we're gonna stick with this and um, yeah so again we got a big change here from this to this so yeah that's very cool and um, yep so it's the same uh, if you want to do it with a black and white image it's it's exactly the same thing um, just do ex the just follow the steps I just showed you and you'll get um, you know just a really cool image so again thanks for watching this um, very awesome from you and um, yep thanks to Tutvid uh, thanks to all to all the people who just watched this video and Please make sure you subscribe, comment, and rate, and make sure you check out my channel for other awesome uh, f Adobe collection, let's say, Photoshop, AK Photoshop, and Adobe After Effects, and probably I'm going to do a bit of um, Vegas Pro tutorials, and yeah, if you really liked it, go check out my channel and subscribe, alright, and thanks for watching this, this was Spartan Bruno, and have a great day, and yep. See you guys.